Hey friends, we have made it to our first stop of this trip. It's Bandelier National Monument. There's so much to see and do, so let's get started. So we're here at the Bandelier National Monument and we're about to do just kind of the, the nature trail that starts from the visitor center. And so if you look, turn around, you'll see just the cool bluffs and that we're going to go through. There's some bluff dwellings, cliff dwellings, and so we're going to go check them out. So we are on the nature trail at Bandelier National Monument. And uh, it's about, what, 1.1 mile, mm -hmm. uh, mostly paved. And it goes all along the rocks, right along the edge of the bluff over there, where you can see where the cliff dwellings were. It's really spectacular, really nice. Out of all the cliff dwellings that we've been to, this is by far my favorite okay. so far. And I mean, we just got here. Yeah, I mean, it's really cool. You can climb the ladders, go up into them. Um, it, I mean, if you've been to Mesa Verde, if you've been to Gila or Walnut Canyon, those are all good. This one was just really nice. It reminds me a little bit of Montezuma's Castle, but... But Montezuma, you can go in it. But you can go, right? <laughs> Montezuma's Castle is like you go, there's one thing, you see it, and they're done. This is just, you continue along the edge of this bluff, and it's just beautiful. Really, really nice. We're here in the afternoon on April, in early April. And man, the temperature was great. It got a little hot on the sun. The afternoon sun hits the hits that side, but uh, and we have the place practically to ourselves. Yeah, the park ranger she told us to definitely do this trail right now because it was less trafficked, and she said tomorrow is going to be because tomorrow's insane. Saturday. It's yeah, the weekend. It's the weekend, and so she said it would be really crowded, and she's right. We have this place basically to ourselves. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Put this on your list. It's a must-do. Remember, it is Bandelier National Monument in near Santa Fe or near Los Alamos, New Mexico. So I'm just adding lettuce, carrots, some tomatoes, some slivered almonds, some fried wonton strips, Asian salad dressing, and we're going to have the smoked salmon alongside. And there you have it. Dinner. So, for tomorrow, what's the agenda? So for tomorrow, so there's Bandolero National Monument. Was it? We're here. We went down to the visitor center. We could go back down to the visitor center if we want to do the Falls Trail. 
So that's the one that goes to the falls, and it's supposed to be pretty. Um, and then if I, oh, that's the one she recommended. Yeah, too. she recommended that one. And then if it's open, I would like to go to the alcove house. We can check the visitor center see if it's open. But um, and then if we drive back down, we can go to the White uh, Right Rock Canyon Overlook, drive to it, and then there's the Sankawi section of Bandelier, and it has some overlooks and some uh, things. You got to climb ladders up to those as well. Cliff dwellings and all kinds of stuff. And then we can go into Los Alamos, we can check it out. And then as we're leaving, not tomorrow, but Sunday, we're gonna go up Highway 4 and we're gonna go up here to Val Caldera National Preserve. Okay. Sounds good. So we are back at the camper. We're going to make some sandwiches, have a little bit of lunch, and then we are going to head out again for our second round. coming up on this, this is a pile of rocks and this part of the park is unexcavated and so this is probably ancient remains of something and even right here where people have found bits of uh, ancient pottery people find it along the trail right obviously they don't want you taking it but people will put it into piles so that you can so that everybody can enjoy it and see it Normally, this is the kind of stuff that you would see in an archaeological site that would be in a, in a museum under glass. Yeah. But you can touch it. Yeah. And, you know. Yeah, it's amazing. And just walking around, you see it everywhere. It's like, as everywhere. you're walking, it's everywhere. There's pottery. There's some volcanic glass. Some of it's bigger than others. Some pieces are bigger than others really really nice really special place yeah
All right, guys, thanks for watching. Be sure to hit the like and subscribe button um, if you want to see more content like this and more of our adventures. We had an awesome time at Bandelier National Monument, and so we're going to call it a day, call it a night, eat some great jambalaya. And watch the ball game. Watch the ball game, and then we're off to our next destination tomorrow, and we'll let you know where that is when we get there. We'll catch you on the road. Thanks.